Hello students hope you are doing well Electrical engineering is one of the most sought after courses in engineering for which lakhs of students apply every year The course is of undergraduate level which is of a total of 4 years duration Each year is divided into two semesters and the exam are conducted after each semester There are tons of career opportunities that the candidates can pursue after completing their BTech in electrical engineering course. In this video we'll talk about all the important details for BTech electrical engineering course such as eligibility, admission process, fees, career prospects, colleges, etc. Before moving forward, let us know a bit about BTech electrical engineering course. Power generation and power plant management are the two most important sectors of any nation. Power and electricity are the most important part of people's lives as well as for the development of the nation. Therefore, there is a huge need for proficient electrical engineers in the country. Since there are ample of jobs available in this field, BTech in electrical engineering is one of the most popular courses among engineering aspirants. The course trains the candidates to understand systems, procedures and machines that are essential in power production. There are various industries and companies which have a demand for electrical engineers. The mentioned Top recruiters for electrical engineering in India includes Indian Railways, Coal India Limited, ISRO, NDMSC, and some of the other private recruitment sectors. These sectors recruit the candidates on the basis of a written test and interview. Now, let us look at some of the most important course highlights for BTech Electrical Engineering course. The name of the course is BTech that is Bachelor's of Technology in Electrical Engineering. Minimum eligibility is to pass class 12th in PCM stream. The course is of a total of 4 years duration. The various entrance exams that are conducted for admission include JE Main, JE Advance, WBJE, AP EM Set, TS EM Set, KEAM, KCET, MHT Set, etc. The admission process is divided into three processes. One is on the basis of an entrance exam. Second is through the centralized counseling, and third is direct admission on the basis of management quota. The candidates who have passed diploma in electrical engineering can also get admission directly to the second year of BTEC electrical engineering which is also known as lateral entry admission. The average fee for the course in private universities or colleges is around 1,15,000 per annum and for the government colleges is roughly around 40,000 per year. There are various scholarships for the course which ranges in Dean University Scholarships, State Government Scholarships and AICT 5% Tuition Fee Waiver Scheme. The internship option is also available for students from the second to third year of the course. Now let us look at the eligibility which is required for BTEC Electrical Engineering course. The candidate must have passed class 12th with a minimum of 50% of marks. The candidate must have studied physics, chemistry and mathematics as the major subjects in class 12th. There is no maximum age limit to apply for BTEC in electrical engineering and the candidates who are in their final year of examination or are awaiting for their class 12th results can also apply for admission in any college. Now let us look at the admission process for BTEC electrical engineering course. For admission into IITs, the admission is done on the basis of JE advanced score through JOSA counseling. Admission into NITs, triple ITs and GFTIs is done on the basis of JE main score and through JOSA counseling. Admission to private engineering colleges can be either done on the basis of state level entrance exam or direct admission on the basis of merit obtained by candidates in 12th exam. Admission to private deemed university is done either on the basis of 
एंट्रेंस एग्जाम कंडक्टेड बाई द यूनिवर्सिटी इट सेल्फ और ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ डायरेक्ट एडमिशन थ्रू मैनेजमेंट कोटा नाउ लेट एस लुक एट द सिलेबस फॉर बी टेक इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग फॉर द फोर ईयर फॉर फर्स्ट ईयर द सिलेबस कंटेन सब्जेक्ट सच एज प्रोफेशनल कम्युनिकेशन इन्वामेंटल स्टडीज फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स वन इंजीनियरिंग फिजिक्स वन इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स टू इंजीनियरिंग केमिस्ट्री फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग टेक्निकल कम्युनिकेशन फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स इंजीनियरिंग इंजीनियरिंग ड्राॅइंग एंड फंडामेंटल्स ऑफ कंप्यूटर द सेकेंड ईयर सिलेबस कंसिस्ट ऑफ सब्जेक्ट सच एज मैकेनिक्स ऑफ सॉलिड्स इंजीनियरिंग मैथमेटिक्स थ्री डिजिटल सर्किट्स इलेक्ट्रिकल मेजरमेंट्स अप्लाइड थर्मोडाइनमिक्स एनालॉग सर्किट्स सिग्नल्स एंड सिस्टम्स मैनेजेरियल इकोनॉमिक्स डेटा स्ट्रक्चर्स इलेक्ट्रिकल मशीन वन सर्किट थ्योरी एंड न्यूमेरिकल एंड स्टैटिस्टिकल मेथड्स द थर्ड ईयर सिलेबस कंसिस्ट ऑफ सब्जेक्ट सच एज इलेक्ट्रिकल मशीन टू पावर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स माइक्रो प्रोसेसर्स एंड कंप्यूटर ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इलेक्ट्रिकल पावर जनरेशन कंट्रोल सिस्टम्स वन पावर सिस्टम्स फील्ड थ्योरी माइक्रो प्रोसेसर बेस्ड सिस्टम कंप्यूटर एप्लीकेशन इन पावर सिस्टम्स कंट्रोल सिस्टम्स टू डिजिटल सिग्नल प्रोसेसिंग एंड इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन द फोर्थ ईयर सिलेबस कंसिस्ट ऑफ सब्जेक्ट सच एज इलेक्ट्रिकल मशीन एंड पावर सिस्टम डिजाइन स्पेशल पर्पज इलेक्ट्रिकल मशीन ऑपरेशन रिसर्च माइंड इलेक्ट्रिकल टेक्नोलॉजी इलेक्ट्रिकल ड्राइव इलेक्ट्रिक ट्रांसपोर्टेशन एडवांस्ड पावर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स ऑप्टो इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स स्विच गियर एंड प्रोटेक्शन कम्युनिकेशन इंजीनियरिंग पावर प्लांट इंस्ट्रूमेंटेशन एंड कंट्रोल हाई वोल्टेज इंजीनियरिंग एंड वन मेजर प्रोजेक्ट नाउ लेट एस लुक एट द वेरियस करियर ऑप्शन एंड जॉब प्रोस्पेक्ट आफ्टर परस्यूइंग बी टेक इन इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग कोर्स इन इंडिया द करियर ग्रोथ फॉर इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग इज स्प्लेंडेड सम ऑफ द इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियर्स इवन गेट क्वालिफाइड टू अटेन मैनेजमेंट पोजिशन सुपरवाइजिंग अ टीम ऑफ इंजीनियर्स और टेक्नीशियंस इंजीनियरिंग मैनेजर्स or program managers and much more the candidates who wish to go to the higher positions have to pursue research and post graduate programs in the field of electrical engineering electrical engineers can see the following profiles after completing their course electrical engineer electrical sales engineer engineering associate professor or lecturer electrical design engineer and staff electrical engineer Now let us look at the average salary for a BTEC electrical engineering aspirant. The salary after pursuing BTEC in electrical engineer is completely based on the skills and knowledge of the candidate. The basic pay that is offered by most of the private companies ranges somewhere in between 2 lakh 50000 to 5 lakhs per annum. individuals with with exceptional communication and math skill can also get higher packages that means it all depends on your capabilities and experience that's all for today thank you if you have any questions you can reach to me through the link that has been provided below meanwhile if you are looking for direct admission in the engineering courses in any state you can also fill the common application form on the provided link for more updates on btech courses and admission process stay tuned to college tech thank you if you like this video do like share comment and subscribe to our youtube channel